Masha and Dasha story is probably one of the most important case studies in all of healthcare as it relates to the immune system and what we can learn about the immune system. Now, Masha and Dasha were two Siamese twins. They were conjoined at the waist, as you can see in this picture above here. They had separate hearts, they had separate lungs, they had separate digestive tracts, they had separate brains and separate spinal cords. The only thing that they shared in common was that they had the same circulatory system or the same blood flowing through their body. Now the interesting thing with Masha and Dasha is that one of the twins, Masha, would get sick and the other one, Dasha, wouldn't. Now if they had the same circulatory system flowing through them, why is it that one of the twins would get sick and the other one wouldn't? Well, the reason is, is because they had separate nerve systems. If we look at this diagram here, we can see the two twins conjoined at the waist if one of them has a subluxation in the spine, that's going to increase stress hormones like cortisol, epinephrine, and norepinephrine. And as a result, it's going to downregulate the immune function in the body. So a subluxation here causes that increase in stress hormones. As a result, the immune system gets suppressed and decreased. The other twin has no subluxations. As a result, the immune system is working better and there's no stress hormones and this twin isn't getting sick. So this is a powerful case study and we can learn a lot here and it's a great reminder that chiropractic isn't just about headaches and neck pain and back pain, it's also about getting the nerve system to work better and as a result, getting the immune system to work better too. I hope this video is valuable. If you liked it, please comment below and share it with somebody you know. Thanks for watching.